So today we're going over what the rarest enemies in vanilla Terraria are. Now this is going to be a different video than usual because originally I was just going to do a top 5 or top 10 rarest Terraria enemies video. But once I started doing research for that video I realized that the Terraria wikis don't give an exact spawn percentage or number ratio of any sort on a majority of these enemies wiki pages. So let's start this video with going to the Terraria wiki and typing in rare enemies. This will bring us to the lifeform analyzer accessory page and on this page we will see all the rare enemies, NPCs, and critters that the lifeform analyzer detects. If you look closely, you'll notice that the word rarity is next to the enemies label, and upon even closer inspection, you'll notice that only 16 out of the 24 enemies shown have an actual number correlating to their rarity. So according to this Terraria wiki, Tim and the normal gold, ice, and shadow chest mimics are the rarest enemies in the game. Now, before we get deeper into this video, let me preface that all of us that play Terraria will always have a different experience from each other. And what I mean is sometimes Sometimes people will run into Tim in their first 10 minutes of playing and other people may have never ever have seen Tim in the hundreds and thousands of hours that they have in the game. With that said, let us assemble a top 5 rare story enemies list with the information in order given by the wiki. So starting from rarest to less rare, we have our rarest enemy in Tim at number 1. Moving to our number 2 spot, we have regular chest mimics. Next up at our number 3 spot is the groom, then after that is the bride at number 4. And last but not least, the tactical skeleton at number five now some of you may be like gamer this that list doesn't really seem right and honestly i would agree with you like i said earlier this wiki doesn't really give exact percentages or ratios of how rare some of these enemies are so to get to the bottom of this we're going to be using a mod called modders toolkit by jopo jelly and we're going to try and get the exact percentages of some of these enemies so here we are we are in the world with the modders toolkit mod and if you look in the bottom right here it says click to toggle modders toolkit boom we click that and then we get all of these options right here but the one we're going to be focusing on is the npc spawn tool now as you see when i open up the npc spawn tool you'll see this right here you click on calculate and boom it will give you all the percentages of the current biome you're standing in and what mobs are going to spawn there and uh you know if we're standing in the ocean biome we'll get ocean mobs if we're standing in hell we'll get hell mobs stuff like that and uh, as you can see the rarest critter is the golden squirrel these percentages i'm assuming are very you know subjective to change especially if you're playing with mods because obviously mods add in more monsters and critters and stuff so percentages will change based on that and I'm also assuming percentages will change once we're in hard mode so what we're gonna do to test this is we're gonna check out a bunch of the areas pretty much all the areas where these monsters the rarest monsters can spawn and we're gonna test the ones that are pre-hard mode in pre-hard mode and then we're gonna test the ones that are hard mode in hard mode and then the ones we tested in pre-hard mode we're gonna also test in hard mode just to get you know that number also in hard mode you Got what i'm saying i don't know it's pretty confusing i'm kind of confused myself all right so here we are we are on the outer edges of the map and i'm assuming that pinky and the goblin scout spawn out here but obviously the percentages are subject to change they're not going to be exact but they're going to be the closest thing we can get to an exact percentage so let's hit calculate and let's, let's see what happens so something interesting happened the king slime spawn and the king slime does have a chance to you know randomly spawn when you're on the outer thirds of the maps i don't know how rare this is all right yeah, let's go ahead let's 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 calculate this and we're getting a bunch of numbers here the king slime has awoken again what's going on here is it every time i hit calculate as you can see here goblin scout 2.17 percentage that's what we're getting for him it seems that the king slime spawns every time i hit calculate but you know you could you could put all these numbers here together of the goblin scout it's like in that 2.30 2.5 40 range okay nice all right here we are we are in a granite cave slash lower cave level and uh we're gonna hit calculate a couple times see if we can get tim or the rune wizard on here starting with our first calculation boom i see tim at 0.04 percent that that's pretty slim of a chance we scroll up a little bit we got the lost girl also known as the nymph at 0.41 percent chance very very low too let me go ahead calculate here again tim 0.07 percent this time and uh lost girl at 0.07 37 undead miner on here at 0.28 percent now i know he isn't the rarest thing ever but he's he's pretty rare according to this so yeah obviously we're not gonna see the rune wizard uh, i might have misspoke earlier and said let me see if we can find the rune wizard i meant to say let me see if we can just find tim because the rune wizard spawns in only hard mode all right here we are we're in the underground jungle which is where the elusive dr bones spawns and i'll be honest dr bones is one of those ones that i rarely ever see i've seen like once or twice and uh let's see what kind of percentage 
percentages we get here we're getting a very very minimal 0.07 percent same thing with the lost girl Let's see again damn he went to 0.03 percent where's the lost girl on this she went up to 0.11 can we does he go lower than that it's looking like this purple salamander is really low what the heck come to think of it i don't think i've ever seen a purple salamander but yeah dr bones he kind of fluctuates between that 0.03 percent and 0.07 percent all right so we have the blood moon here and we're gonna see the bride in the groom spawn rate let's go ahead and calculate we got a percentage of 0.30 and 0.37 actually not too bad go ahead calculate it again got 31 32 31 35 that groom stand at a solid 30 oh went down to 26 the bride 37 these two actually do see a decent amount uh, at least once every couple of playthroughs definitely not as rare for me as dr bones is we are here in the dungeon trying to figure out the spawn rate for the dungeon slime you see the mechanic didn't really spawn inside of the dungeon interesting and she's getting destroyed because of her mistakes oh leaving her alive all right spoke too damn soon but yeah let's go ahead let's calculate this and the dungeon slime has a 2.30 percent probably the highest percentage we've seen so far but also extremely low 2.30 compared to you know the bound mechanic who has the highest percentage apparently let's go ahead let's calculate it again dungeon slime at 2.58 226 2 exactly 232 okay the blazing wheel you know maybe not directly an enemy but that thing's pretty rare all right we have now entered hard mode and we're gonna try and find the rune wizard and mimics percentages so let's go ahead let's calculate it so the rune wizard is at 0 0.10 percent and the mimics are at 0.94 which is pretty surprising because the mimics the regular mimics they have a higher rarity on the wiki than the rune wizard go ahead let's calculate it again rune wizard at a 0 0.01 percentage and the mimics at 0 0.81 mimics again pretty high up there near one percent and the rune wizard underneath tim and you know what's weird again is that the rune wizard has got a lower rarity than tim does on the wiki so like i don't, I don't know what to believe in here i definitely think the rune wizard is more rare than tim well actually i don't know i feel like i've seen both of them the same amount of times honestly but it seems like a majority of times when i calculate the spawn he's under tim but this time tim underneath him calculated again boom he's underneath tim so that's 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 very interesting information all right we are here in the jungle to see the moth spawn rate the moth has a 0.14 spawn rate and uh you know check out the mimics while we're at it 0.51 for the mimics this time 0.17 for moth and 0.40 for mimics 0.20 for the moth and 0.57 for the mimics so the moth pretty rare but i i still feel like it's an enemy i definitely see a decent amount of times especially while being in the jungle so we are down here in hell we're gonna check out the tortured soul spawn rate which is definitely you know a rare enemy slash npc whatever you want to consider it i see it every once in a while it's definitely not an npc slash enemy i see every game but he has a 4.97 percentage probably gonna stay in that four to five percent range that's actually that's pretty high probably the highest we've seen on this list but i, f I don't know man i feel like i never seen him. and also you see right here we're getting hollowed mimics because we are in a hollowed mine we'll check them out in a second but for now the tortured soul i believe is the highest percentage we've seen all right we are here on the surface snow biome we're trying to find out the spawn rate for the ice golem so let, let us see let us see we do have a blizzard going on which is needed for the ice golem and he has a 4.88 percent spawn rate probably going to be in that four to five area yep that's what it's looking like and i definitely see ice golems every playthrough a good couple of them he's definitely not the rarest enemy on this list all right i have made this area by the dungeon hollowfied hollowfied whatever you want to say i turned it into the hollow and we're gonna see the percentage for the rainbow slime which i believe is one of the rarest enemies in the game and i don't think i've ever seen the enemy in vanilla but i've seen it in modded because of i had potions in a modded playthrough that allowed the spawn rate to go up like 10 times the normal spawn rate so let's go ahead let's calculate it let's see rainbow slime 4.21 really i thought it would be way higher than that or way lower than that so it's in that three to four area still pretty rare i feel like the circumstances for this enemy to spawn are a lot harder to come by needs to be raining need to be in a hollowed biome one of those things you need to be in hard mode to see but uh you know that, that's pretty surprising that's that high up there i feel like it's one of those enemies that i never ever see all right here we are back in the dungeon after killing plantera so we are now in the hard mode dungeon and we're trying to figure out the spawn rates for a bunch of the rarer skeletons and the paladin so let us go ahead and see let's scroll down the paladin at 0.11 percent let's go ahead calculate a 
couple of times for the paladin paladin just vanished from this list that that's a weird sign you know if an enemy just vanishes from the list are, is that even are they considered more rare go ahead let's calculate again paladin oh there he is 1.73 now paladin i do definitely see a good bit in playthroughs so you know i'm not too surprised that he's you know in that 1.0 area even the 2.0 2.0 area but yeah now we want to check out the skeletons the tactical skeleton sitting at a 0 0.26 0 0.41 tactical skeleton i think he has some really rare circumstances to get him to spawn like don't they need like a certain like brick wall in the back i'm pretty sure it's like one of the things required for some of these skeletons to spawn in but i remember i was hunting for the tactical skeleton for one playthrough and i could never find him but yeah other than him the skeleton sniper in that 1.30 area 1.0 area bone lee in that 3.0 area i'm assuming maybe four even higher than that skeleton commando he's also here so yeah it's those four bone lee skeleton commando the sniper and the tactical skeleton those are those are four of them that are on that very rare life form analyzer list all right so let us go ahead we're gonna figure out the biome mimic spawn rate we're gonna do the corruption one and the hollowed one we're not gonna do the crimson one because i'm assuming the crimson one is gonna be the same as pretty much the corruption one but let's go ahead and let's see we are getting a 0.57 same thing with the regular mimic is at 0.57 very interesting this time 0.43 and 0.41 for the regular mimic and the corrupted mimic this time the regular mimics at 0.36 while the corrupted mimic is at 0.64 so it seems that these two are very close to each other but they can fluctuate very hard all right we are in an underground hollowed biome and the hollowed mimic is at 0.42 percent here at 0.43 near the regular mimics too so yeah pretty much the same thing as a corrupted one it's going to be near the regular mimic spawn rate fluctuating here and there all right i have now defeated the golem so we're going to see the spawn rate for the martian probe a good 15.41 that's that's pretty high up there given that there's not too many things up here in you know space that can spawn so uh you know honestly i, I feel like i kind of expected that but at the same time i feel like sometimes martian probes just straight up don't spawn and that goes along with what i talked about earlier with rng and just being lucky in terms of you know seeing things for example some people will see tim all the time some people will never see him all right here we are in a sandstorm a, a hollow sand biome slash sandstorm and uh let's go ahead let's see the spawn rate for the sand elemental 3.19 that's that's definitely believable i definitely have trouble finding the sand elemental during sandstorms and uh it's in that 2 2.5 3.0 area it seems like oh even even dipping lower than 2.5 2.39 so yeah two to three area so the reason i didn't show off pinky is because pinky on its wiki page actually has a spawn ratio and a spawn chance it says on the wiki page pinky has a one in 180 chance 0.56 percent of spawning in place of any standard slime so that, that's the main reason i didn't show off pinky but yeah i don't think i'm gonna show off the percentages of the pre-hard mode monsters because they don't really change too much they either go up a little bit or they go down so it seems like the rarest enemy in the game is the rune wizard standing at a low 0.01 percent with tim right behind him and then i believe the lost girl near them I, I don't know i might be i might be off on that third one but it's definitely rune wizard and tim are two of the rarest enemies in the game and i believe rune wizard being just over tim by a little bit but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video very scientific and research intensive video you know did a lot of research here we may not come out with exact numbers we did come out with some somewhat of a conclusion to you know signify or figure out which is the rarest enemy in the game but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to sub to this youtube channel or like the video if you enjoyed it sub to my second youtube channel follow my twitch follow my twitter enjoy my discord i, I hope you guys enjoyed the video my name is gamers 101 i'll see y'all next time i love you